and everybody. Hopefully we are all good now. Um, unfortunately, it appears that Verizon is not like my best friend and it decided to just completely drop. I'm hoping it doesn't happen again. I assume it wouldn't. Like, um, as you know, I've, I've done so many things to like try to keep my internet like stable. It's ridiculous, man. I bought this 30 foot or $30 like 150 foot ethernet cord. And it's like, uh, it's like category six or whatever, which is like, everyone's like, yeah, that's more than you'd need like in your house. Like cat five is fine. I'm like, no, cat six, you're the best cord. I want five star brand, man. I don't care how much it is, 30, $40, whatever, I'll buy it. Just give me a cord that I can count on that won't just fault very quickly in like a week or two with barely like anything ever touching it. So I buy that cord, we have my uninterruptible power source so that, uh, cause yeah, I do have uh, problems generally more in the summer and uh, where I live where like essentially everyone in my neighborhood will be like using their air conditioners and like they'll be on high. And yeah, the power will go out because it's just too much demand, which sucks. But uh, yeah, that'll usually happen. It usually just causes a flicker. Like it's not like the whole power goes out. It's usually fluctuations in the power, especially in this room. I have uh, bad wiring in this room in comparison to the rest of the house. So like, I got the uninterruptible power source. So whenever the power flickers, my computer will not shut down because you know normally if the power is gone for even like a quarter of a second like that's too much the computer is dead you have to turn it back on but no have a battery for it so it stays on now i'm like all right it should be good but nope verizon verizon's letting me down man i mean i haven't had this problem before where the internet just drops in the whole house, no power problems or anything like that, just literally <laughs> no internet. It's weird, man. Oh, man. <laughs> My internet needs to get good as well? Yeah, well, fair enough, man. One day. But see, at least you weren't about to get a world record when your run went out. <laughs> Thanks, like, mine. Yeah, rest in peace, friends. I mean, I was on PB Pace. I was easily on PB Pace. I mean, I hadn't done Flying Battery yet, so we might have just messed that up really hard, but we'd practiced that for like two hours today, so I uh, felt pretty good about it. But yeah, we were easily on PB Pace. I probably would have saved about two minutes. It's like, uh, my splits are definitely not right. Like, there's eight minutes between, like, Chemical Plant Act 1 and Act 2. It's not supposed to be 8 minutes. Easily could have saved 2 minutes there. But, something went wrong. And I lost the run. As I lost the stream. Feels bad, man. Feels bad. Hashtag blame Horizon. Uh, Verizon, not the Horizon, excuse me. I like looking at the Horizon. Well, that's a lie. I don't actually like looking outside in general. Every now and then, I guess. But yo, um, for whatever reason, my webcam works now. I didn't change any of my settings. I just turned OBS Studio back on and my webcam works. I don't know why. I didn't change literally anything, but now I have a webcam. <laughs> it just exists now. So weird. <laughs> I'm right there, is the thanks. I mean, I would hope you would notice. <laughs> I would hope you'd be able to notice that I'm here now. Didn't even notice him there. Kappa! Wait, why did I split there? You don't you don't split there, Vinx. Not quite. Not so much. Trolley says, I'll be honest. I would not have realized that you appeared when you weren't there before if you hadn't been there before. Okay? I guess? I mean, alright. Get out of here, you evil boss, you! I can see through your shenanigans. Words are hard? They are very hard. Very difficult. It's been a long day. That's fine, man. That's fine. Everybody now and then is gonna have a long day. 
Why am I 40 seconds behind? What did I do? I don't feel like I did anything that was 40 seconds behind. I mean, my Angel Island was a little slow. It wasn't 40 seconds slow. It was probably all the Chaos Emerald. Oh, whoops. I probably could have done the Chaos Emerald better. <laughs> Breakfast was 9.30 p.m., so yeah. Yeah, no, nah, that's, that's no good, man. That's way too late to be having breakfast. What kind of day have you been having, man? Apparently a pretty tough one. Yo, hope, uh, hope you at least have a good night. That would be nice. Oh, so close to Mach 2. Give me what I want. There we go. Throw all the blue spheres. Need that Mach 3, man. Need that Mach 3. Yeah, don't, don't hit that. Alright, quick Mach 3, but uh, UFO is a good distance away. Maybe the other path is better. I've yet to perfect. But I have no idea. I need to time it, I just never time it. I always forget to do so. Platinum rings. Should probably grab some of those. There you go. Okay, yeah, you catch up to the UFO pretty fast. Wait, come here, guy. Um, let's see. My parents left early this morning, and I spent a lot of time with my aunt, who is recovering from literal brain surgery. Then my buddy had a baby shower for his five-week-old, and we are geeks, so we played a lot of games, but I sort of forgot about eating. <laughs> yeah, that's fair, man. That's fair. I've definitely done that before. You know, man, that stuff is tough. But yeah, I have one friend of mine. That, uh, has been on my stream before, Kentre. Like, we would hang out sometimes, and we'll play, like, say, Street Fighter. And we'll go, like, um... A hundred games. Like, literally a hundred games. He'll get 50 wins, I'll get 50 wins. We never plan it out, it just usually goes that way. We're both very close to each other in, uh, skill level. Like, extremely. And then we're like, man, we played so many games, I can't believe we played a hundred. And then we'll realize, oh yeah, we haven't, uh, we haven't eaten anything today, have we? <laughs> and then, you know, gotta go sort that out. Hey man, remembering to do things is difficult when there's video games to be had. Video games are very important. Alright, so on this one, there is a blue arrow to grab, and we will get that blue arrow, and it will be great. Ah, and blue arrow. Good job. Ugh. Not my best turn there. I would have to say not quite. I've had better turns. Ah, oh, so close. Ah, oh, I hate that. I hate being like right next to it and not getting it, but we got it there, so that's cool. <laughs> Remembering to eat less than video games? Yeah, no, man, it's not as good. It's not as good. We have priorities. Priorities, man. Especially if you're uh, hanging out with people you don't know. Always hang out with, man. Gotta get those games in. Yo, good hit, Sonic. And then... Got him! You know, I'm getting better at grabbing that capsule, man. Ah, this is not as fast as we were last time. I was like 30 seconds faster before. Feels bad, man. I don't even know how it was that fast. It was ridiculous. 
Yeah, there we go. Give me one of the rings. Hmm, I didn't mean to go this way. <laughs> this way's a little bit slower. Speaking of the important part of that, you want to play more Octopath? Oh yeah, gotta play Octopath, man. Yeah, I actually started playing it again, um, yesterday. I wasn't, like, continuing my playthrough so much as, um, I was talking to Sturmcrow, and, uh, he was saying, like, how difficult the game is and how much grinding you need to do. And I was saying, well, I haven't done, um, a lot of the game yet. I've only done all the chapter ones, so I don't know how difficult it gets. But I imagine it can't be too bad, because you can fight the level one... Oh, snap! <laughs> Yo, Catrolli is skipped to the tier one sub to hydrated by... Oh, snap. <laughs> Yo, Catrolli, thank you very much, man. Yo, way too nice, way too nice. Did not see that one coming. That one that one shook me a little bit. You saw the pause, right? I, I didn't know what it was, and I tried to react very quickly, and I was like, Oh, it's okay, Binks. The world's not on fire. It's just... <laughs> you're just getting a sub. Oh, man. Oh, and then I hit that and timed out. Focus, focus is hard for me. <laughs> you interrupted, you're sorry? Yeah, no, it's all good, man. It's not your fault. <laughs> it's not your fault, I was just being bad. I, uh, definitely could have done that better. And yo, Marty the Party's in here. Time was bad anyways. I mean, it wasn't super bad, but it could definitely be better. Let's, let's do that. But, uh, what was I saying before I was rudely interrupted with a sub? <laughs> but, uh, no, I was saying that, um... Oh, jeez, what was I saying? Uh... Something about video games, right? Maybe? I don't know! I was telling the story and I've forgotten what it was. And, uh, Katrina was saying, Yeah, grinding isn't necessary, but my buddy is grinding a bit. I'm grinding a bit, but less because I need to and more because I want to. Oh, you were asking to have more votes trolled for that? No, 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 no. It's all good. Now I remember what I was talking about, thanks to uh, the conversation. Mm hmm, we were saying, I almost pulled my headphones off. Um, we were saying that, uh, oh yeah, Stormcrow was like, yeah, you have to grind, and I'm like, you don't really have to. Or at least, again, with my little experience with the game, doing the chapter one bosses. And yeah, big Joker with my heart, thank you very much. Yeah, the chapter one bosses. I had beaten, um, one of those at level 1 with Aphelion. I was like, yeah, I beat at level 1 with no equipment. So, I assume you probably don't have to grind too much for this game. And he was like, what? Level 1? You can't do that. I was like, yeah, you can. And I linked to my video of, uh, Aphelia beating the boss with just the default equipment. Just her. And he was like, oh, wow, that's, that's pretty nifty. But he was like, yeah, probably only Aphelia and Primrose could do that. <laughs> I was like, you want to bet? I accept your challenge, and so I pulled the uh, pulled the switch out, and I tried. I was trying to decide who it would be, and I was like, "You can't." I wanted to do Old Barrett. I was like, "You can't do Old Barrett because he's level two by default, because you have to fight these two guys in his town to continue his storyline. So you can't fight the boss at level one. It's, it's impossible." Oh man, <laughs> my movement's such trash. So what I did instead was I decided to try, um, what's his name, Cyrus? No, not Cyrus. Ah, oh, what's his name? The, the Apothecary. I played as the Apothecary. And yeah, that was a super easy boss fight. I was gonna make a video about it, but I couldn't decide if it was worth it. Cause like, Aphelia's boss fight at level one's a little difficult. The Apothecary's like, yeah, it'll keep poison you, but as long as you heal yourself, it's a, it's a really easy fight. Like, I don't think you can lose it, so. I don't know. Maybe if I combine it with like the level or the four group version of it. But I don't have the audio for that unless I like do all of that all over again. And I don't know if I want to do all that. It's like obviously for the video, I need audio that doesn't have me commentating over it already. Yeah, I'll figure that out. Yo, how am I doing, Marty? Yo, I'm doing good. My internet kicked out for a little bit, and that was sad, but the internet came back, so all is dandy in the world. Apothecary's a lot more difficult later on. Yeah, yeah, he's definitely more difficult later on, because that's the first time I did the Apothecary fight. 
He was my second to last character I got, I believe. Because the, um, the last one was the Thief. And I think right next to the Thief is the Apothecary. So I did the, you know, the full four team fight really late on. And I know that the bosses scale with how many characters you have. So it was definitely more difficult. Um, but it wasn't as hard as, like, say, some of the other, like, full team fights were. Like, the hardest full team fight for me, I think, was... Oh, who was it? I'm trying to remember the bosses. Um, was it... No, it wasn't the two pirates. That was easy. It must have been Primrose. I think Primrose's one was the hardest one. No, no, Primrose one wasn't the hardest. He would just one-hit my guys sometimes. There was another one that would one-hit me and had like a really good status effect that I had to deal with. Who was it? I can't remember. But either way, the Apothecary was easy. Gosh darn it, thanks. Why can I not do this boss? This boss is so easy. I swear. <laughs> you see me, Magic Enforcer? Yes, I am back. I've returned. I exist again. Ah, jeez. I don't know how I feel about this. I mean, we're 10 seconds faster than that other run, so I'll take it. I'd like to complete a run today, even if it's not the best. Whatever, man. Work with what you got. Then we need the fire shield. Troll is saying, my hardest full team fight was the Apothecary. None of the others gave you any difficulty, but you started with Cyrus and abused his abilities and grinded a fair bit. Yeah, that's fair. I did literally zero grinding. Well, no grinding on purpose. There's a little bit of unintentional grinding, where uh, there's this cat thing that fought me, and I assumed it was just another monster, and I defeated it. I was thinking I would get like some good treasure or something, and now nah, it gave me a thousand experience. And that was a lot at that point in the game. Not as much like now where I am, but at the time that was a lot of experience. So um, that was pretty cool. But um, but yeah, that was earlier on. Only two of my characters got that. Um, the hunter, uh, what's her name? Haunted or something? And uh, Ophelia. Those are the only characters that managed to get it. They're the only characters I had at the time. And I ran into the cat monster. Oh, so close to Mach 3, it's so far away. There we go. Much better. Well, come back here, UFO. Ooh, I would just run into all of that. <laughs> Not a big deal, though. Got rings for days. Oh, uh, what game is this? This is Sonic Mania. Oh, the run's verified now? Yeah, I saw that, uh... I think Ray's on there. I don't know if they have an Encore mode leaderboard yet for Sonic Mania Plus. It should. And, uh, Control says, yeah, it's called a Kate, and I've killed one of the four I've seen. Yeah, I saw two of them, and I only killed one of them. The first one ran away. But, uh, yeah, outside of that, I never tried to do any grinding. Um, let's see, my third character was... The Mercenary, I think? No, the third character was Cyrus. Cyrus's fight was really easy. The fourth one was the, uh, was the Merchant. And her fight was the two pirates. That was really easy. The fifth one was Olberic. And that one was extremely easy. And then the sixth one was... What? what was the sixth one? Primrose. Somehow I remember something being harder before Primrose, but... Thinking back, I don't remember any of them being hard. Maybe I misremember. I could misremember. That could be a thing. I don't know. I'd have to rewatch it. Have to rewatch my bods and see if I actually did have trouble with the bosses. I know some people just are in general. Apparently, a lot of people have trouble with the Philia, Philia's boss, which makes sense. 
Ophelia's boss has some pretty good stuff going on. Especially if you fight it late, where it has all those little elementals. If you don't have a way to take out all those elementals, you're gonna get wrecked, like you just are. There's no if ands, or buts about it. <laughs> so close! Give to me the Chaos Emerald, thank you. Uh, Cyrus makes the elementals pointless? Oh, okay, okay. Good to know. Yeah, if you don't have a way to take off the elementals, you're gonna have a lot of trouble. I'm guessing most people go there without fighting Cyrus. I know people that are fighting, like, the boss with just Ophelia, like, in my video, and they also still can't do it. And that's the easiest version of the fight. Because, like, you could do it at level 1, but it's just, it's the mechanics, right? Like, as far as mechanics go, you have to, um, either interrupt his, uh, like, that full aura attack, whatever it's called. You have to stop that. Um, or defend it, depending on the circumstances. You can choose a defend option that will save your life. And then outside of that, it's just those elementals, man. The elementals are all you need to worry about. But they have to go down. It's not a, it's not a maybe I'll take the elementals down. It's a you have to thing. Like, even if you hit level 4 and you get, like, that ability that supposedly blocks elemental damage, it doesn't block the elemental's attack! I'm assuming it must count as physical, because, yeah, I used that ability, I tested it out. It does not work. When they count down to zero and they blow up and use an attack that reflects an elemental attack, no! Nope. An elemental might be called an elemental, but its attack is apparently not elemental. Fancy that. Very interesting. Alright, let's try to be good, Banks. Try to be good. Oh, there's a Glackam in here. I wonder what he wants. Probably gonna talk to me about Rayman. That blind thingy. That new blind mode or whatever. Oh, I had no rings. I'm gonna lose. How do I not lose? I would like to not lose. Yes, give me the rings. Thank you. Not losing is way better. Come back! Oh, who barely saved that one. Barely. Yeah, this isn't my best Chaos Emerald here. I've, I've done this one much better. Look at what you got, though. Come on, gay. Alright, uh, so Vinks, how did you end up avoiding the bow on the monk? I felt like there was never a bow as threatening as the one in the hands of the monk. <laughs> um, how did I avoid the bow? Um, I wasn't doing all the things you were doing. Like, I believe you were using, like, no shield and no bow. I'm pretty sure I just shot him. I think I just shot him with my bow. I think that's what I did. I don't remember, though. Either way, like, it was tricky, but it wasn't something I couldn't do. But again, if I remember right, I think you did the fight sword only. I think that's how you did it. Though, <laughs> worth noting, you healed. I didn't do any healing. No, sir, no healing in my playthrough. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Uh-oh! I did not want to fall down there. This is such a time loss. Work with what you got. I'm very depressed. <laughs> I'm incredibly depressed. I can't believe I fell into that. Ah, oh. Gosh darn it, Binks. I'm never gonna finish a run. This is the last one. This is the last run. If I, if I mess up, I'll just keep going. I'll just keep going until I game over. Oh my goodness. I want to complete a run. I'm just so bad. I just mess everything up. Yes, I am salty. Yeah, I'm salty, Magic Enforcer. Want to fight about it? <laughs> I'm pretty salty, man. I'm so sad. 
Uh, Patronus was saying, I mean, all the characters in Octo are very powerful in their own ways. They all have their strength, and you can build them multiple ways, and it's super personalizable. Yes! Which is very true. I just wish that the game would have told me that, you know, I couldn't switch from my main character. Someone told me in chat, but I didn't think it would be that big of a deal. And even then, I didn't know which character I wanted as my main character at the time. I mean, how can you? You only know what one of them does. Yeah, nah, man. That hunter, like, I like her, but... I would much rather have Olberic in that slot. I really would. But I don't like the idea of having both Olberic and Hanit. I think that's her name. Because it's like, they do the same things. They accomplish the same goals. Just Olberic's more consistent than she is. And I like that consistency. Tuesday will be a good day? <laughs> Why will Tuesday be a good day? What's up with Tuesday? I mean, hopefully I'll beat Pokemon White 2 on that day. All I have left is the Elite Four. And the Champion. That should be easy. Blackham says, Heh, I felt like if I was in three hearts and basically dead to any attack, I wouldn't get many chances to heal. And yet it was basically just the Ice Bow and Teleport Smash attack, if not directly blow it, that didn't one-hit KO. Yes, yeah. Um, essentially the way it works, Glackham, uh, Breath of the Wild has a system. I can't remember what the exact values are, but essentially there's many attacks in the game that should KO, and instead of KOing, they'll just reduce you to, like, having that, like, quarter heart or whatever. But, you know, as far as the actual damage the attack deals, it's not doing all the damage it's supposed to do. So, I would, like, I would take it. I was like, if the game didn't kill me, I'll keep going. But I'm not gonna heal off of it. You know, the game's already giving you this, like, oh, man. Oh, yep, I'm bad. The game's already being like, look, you're bad, let me, let me keep you from dying. I'm not gonna let you die, no, no dying for you. And let's see, and yeah, oh yeah, I already read that. Um, Control says, Banks, you have a message on Discord that you obviously missed. Yeah? <laughs> what, what was it? I mean, I generally don't check my Discord midstream. I can. I just don't always. Let's see, where's where's my Discord? Um, Super Judge You. Yep, that's me. I did I did see that. And uh, Vex was saying, I'll watch Mewtwo King and Leffen, blah 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 blah. No, I think I saw everything. How did I miss the button? I don't know what I missed. I was from 10 in this morning? Uh, hmm. What was 10 this morning? Don't know. Wait, was it the message you sent me? I saw that. You said that you had, uh, sent the thing. Is it, uh, supposed to show up on Tuesday? Is that when it's gonna show up, or... Or is that something else that you're referring to? Oh, you did say it would be there by Tuesday. Okay. <laughs> I guess I read the message, but I didn't take in the message. I didn't absorb it. Gosh darn stupid robot cred. Can you see I'm trying to go fast here? I should just be Sonic. Being Sonic would be easier. At least for that part. Next part I kinda wanna be Ray. You're gonna show up J-Globes on Tuesday? Yo, it sounds solid, man. Do it. Yo, my memory's not the strongest control is. Far from it. But you already know this to be true. Oh man, my Green Hill Act 1, I swear, is just getting worse. Just getting worse, man. Ah, oh, come on. I keep messing up, like, little things that are, like, pretty easy. <laughs> Had you questioning your own memory? Oh, yeah, no, nah, man. If someone says that something- they remember something, and that I was there for it, I'll just take their word for it, man. I was like, I don't remember being there. No, you were there! Okay. <laughs> I don't- I don't win memory contests. No, sir. 
Like, I can win knowledge contests if it's something about a video game. Someone's like, oh no, such and such does this. I'm like, no, 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 no. It does that. That I know, man. Knowledge, knowledge, like random knowledge of video games. That's something I generally possess. But memories? What was I doing yesterday? What was I doing an hour ago? I don't know. Something, I guess. Probably. Alright, see you, FO. I'm gonna have to ask you to pull over. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Really bad movement. Really bad movement! Ugh. Okay, we're back in there. Yeah, I was trying to go fast, but speeding myself up there put me in a bad position. I'll one day perfect the momentum jumps. It's a good glitch. I like it quite a bit. I'm just not, uh, just not good at it. No, sir. Or no, uh, <coughs> this is a glitchless playthrough, duh. Glitchless playthrough. Um, let's see. Glacklin was saying, from what I was told, having full health and taking a full hit is supposed to knock you to a quarter heart. That never happened with those moves. Getting hit by the phase one teleport smash did one damage and ice arrows did 1.5. Yes, yes, yes. Um, certain attacks just won't kill you. They should deal more damage than they're dealing. But the way the game is, if you have full health, you won't die. That's how the game is. That's how it was designed. Which, I, I don't mind that. Like, I am not gonna be upset if the game keeps me alive in a place that I should have died from. If the game decides to keep me alive, it is what it is. That's how this game is designed. I'll take it. I'm just saying I wouldn't heal afterwards. That's all I'm saying. Master mode cuts that quarter mechanic out. Oh, does it? Huh. I didn't know that. That's news to me. I could have sworn that I myself had survived in master mode through the quarter heart. Are you sure? Like, I'm not saying what you're saying is not true. I'm just not certain. I must have been very lucky then, in certain situations. I could have sworn that it still worked in Master Mode. But I've been wrong before! Can I be Sonic, please? Oh my goodness. Let me be Sonic. <laughs> You're not too sure, Guesses? Or Guesses. Glackum. I saw the word Guesses right next to Glackum and I said that instead. Um, how far did I get? Um, yeah, I beat Guesses, and that's where I stopped playing. I'm pretty sure they told me to go do the Elite Four, but, like, I literally just kind of, like, stepped out of the cave and then flew to a town. I haven't done anything besides that. No, sir. Blackham says, I've never survived strong attacks with a quarter heart before. Fair enough. I don't know, I saw you doing it when you were fighting the boss, so I just assumed that it was the same way, but I guess attacks were just happening to be dealing, like, two and three quarters heart. I could have sworn that he dealt more damage than that. It's pretty certain. Uh-oh. But yeah, I played Master Mode forever ago. I don't remember. Ah, jeez. But yeah, just watching you play it looked like I saw that mechanic. But perhaps he does do that. Two hearts and three quarters. Maybe that is one of his attacks. Because I saw you get hit at full HP and you didn't die. Was very confused. And I was like, ah yeah, that's Breath of the Wild. It's nice to not kill people. Um, that was at 10, wasn't it? Uh, what was that 10? And uh, Banks, why did you skip the blue spheres at the beginning? Was that intentional? It was not intentional. Reading chat and speedrunning at the same time. <laughs> it's not the best! I just do what I can.
Come on, Sonic. I need you to go up there, not just look around. Doesn't do too much for me. Okay, Ray. Perfect timing. I want to go down there. Come on. Uh, Glackman said, but I did notice getting knocked around before I could get up. Uh, did like nothing? Yeah, no, it's, it's pretty weird, man. I don't know. But we do take those. I hear you on that. I hear you on the we take those. Um, you were at the final boss fight? Round 10? Oh, was I? For the place? I don't think so. Pretty sure when I beat Guesses, that was uh, around midnight. At least Eastern Standard Time Zone. I fit right in the hole! I can't play this game! It's too hard! I'm so bad! I mess up everything! Ah, oh, that's the easy part! The easy part! I haven't gotten to any of the hard parts, and I keep losing at all the easy parts. Today's just not my day. Not my day. I fit perfectly in the hole! Perfectly- no, I'm not trying to Kobe. That's not the goal. The goal is not to get Sonic in the hole. No. Oh, gosh darn it. Gosh, gosh. Gosh, gosh. Gosh darn, man. I'm just no good at these Chaos Emeralds. I have yet to do all seven. I have yet to even get to the seventh Chaos Emerald. The furthest one we've got to is what, five? I don't think we've gotten to the sixth Chaos Emerald yet. Now we've yet to do Studioopolis. We've yet to do Studioopolis. <laughs> it's alright, Vinks. You can do it. Don't get too much salt. I'm pretty salty, man. I'm pretty salty. It's been a while since, like, I've been this bad. But I mean, it makes sense. Because, like, all those other times I was doing Sonic Mania, I was doing, like, um, two to three days in a row. Last week, man, I played Sonic Mania once that week. Only once. It's been a whole week since I've played. And I've just gotten all the bad since then. Well, that wasn't a good day. <laughs> Yo, controllers! <laughs> With all the salty bits and the super Kobe. Gosh, damn it. <laughs> Yo, and even more salty bits saying don't get salty. Oh, man. I'm trying, man. I'm trying not to get salty. I'm awfully salt. Come on, man. Let's let's do what Catrolia says. Let's let's not get all the salt. Uh oh, didn't mean to fall down there. It's mm, not getting salty. Not getting salty. I just clearly wanted to get hit by that bee there. Wait, not nah, salty. Um, tranquil. Happy as a squirrel running through a loop de loop. Not mad at these. Also, plus one to X Cobb, yo, sounds good. So, it took me three hours to get past one ship? Uh, maybe. I don't remember what time I entered the ship at. Cause wait, how did it work? Cause you don't, you don't fight Gestus in the ship, do you? You fight Colrus in the ship. If you fight Colrez, then Colrez is like, you can do what you want to do. And then they like relocate or something. And then you go there. And then like, um, like there's a cave you go through. And you have to. Wait, do you go in a mountain or do you go in the ship again? And then you go outside of the ship and then you go into the cave. And you fight Gestus in there, if I remember right. I think that's how it goes. I mean, I did it, like, just a few days ago, but... I don't know, man. Chat's been kind of crazy the past couple of times I've been playing Pokemon. It's hard to keep track of everything. That's been pretty OP. Nice. That was a really, really good catch there. What took me so long? I don't think anything took me long. We went through it just fine. 
Like after after we fought Colrez, it was all smooth sailing from there. I don't know like what you're using as your basis, J Globes, but uh we just fought everything and everybody lost. It was easy. Gosh darn it, man. Why can I never do this right? Well, that's good. I'll take that. I'll take that. Happily. Still behind, but the best intro I've had all day. Plus seven? Let's go, man. Let's go. No. <laughs> no bugs. Come on, Ray, let's get that fire shield. Wait, actually, yeah, let's grab it in Sonic. This makes it easier. Okay, so for this one, you gotta grab all those blue spheres, man. Grab as many as you can. Oh, I missed like a whole row, man. Positioning wasn't right. Feels bad. Still got a good number of them though. Can't complain too much. Oh, nice! I got Mach 2 here. I don't normally get Mach 2 right there. That's good. That's good. Oh my goodness! I thought they would get out of the way a little sooner. It's a little bit completely wrong about that. Okay, yeah, grab the blue spheres. Oh my goodness, thanks, please. <laughs> oh, I thought I would jump in time, and I didn't. Well, this is a good Mach 3. If I can just not die, this will still be pretty fast, relatively. Nope, nope. Ah, all the bad. All the bad, man. My jumps are always just slightly off what I want. Slightly off. Don't be salty, Binks. No salt. Just go grab the UFO. Yeah, if I had been having a good run, I would have caught the UFO right there. Yeah, <laughs> definitely lost some time there. Uh, Glackman says, well, I just checked. I didn't take any hits on the final attempt anyway. Truly got good? Oh, did you? Okay, nice, man. Nice. Now, uh, Jayglo says, you started the stream on the ship and ended on the last battle. I would think it would only take only an hour to do that. Well, here's the thing, Jayglobes. Um... The ship moves. And it becomes, you have to do it all over again, essentially. You don't, you don't stay on the ship and you just beat the ship and you're done. You beat the ship, and then the ship goes away, and then you have to do a bunch of events. And then after those events are done, you go through a cave, and then you go onto the ship a second time. It's just your perspective is off. That's all. Need rain. There we go. Yo, you're gonna drive? Alright, later, man. Do as you do. I believe in you, Glacken. He has the power. Alright, we gotta be good this time, man. Real good. No falling in any stupid holes. <laughs> no, sir. Not this time. Uh, not into the spikes, please. Here, okay, I got it. Oh, that felt really off, but I guess the UFO at just the right time. Now we just gotta go beat the boss. And yeah, we're, we're on pretty good pace right now. We're on pretty good pace. Not not the greatest in the world, but better than what I usually am on. I'll take it. Yes, sir. If 
Fight the grunts, Colrez. Watch the cutscene and beat Guestless. No, you don't. You don't fight Guestless right after Colrez. It doesn't work like that. The whole ship moves. And uh, let's see. What are you saying? Boa Noite? I guess I, I don't know what you're saying. How you doing, you baggy on? What's up? Excuse you, Mr. Robot. Excuse you. Silly robots getting all up in my way. They should know better. Oh, Brazil? Yeah, I don't I don't speak uh I don't speak anything but English, unfortunately. That's all I got. Alright, what do I yeah, just grab these blue spheres, get a quick Mach 3. There we go. Oh, nice. I don't normally catch it there. That's really good. That's really good for me. Uh, Vexatious saying, hey, just a heads up, Banks. We're heading into the last game of Top 16, so Top 8 will surprisingly be starting on time. <laughs> oh, snap. All right, if my run dies, I'm gonna watch Top 8. And uh, we'll stop streaming early for tonight. But if this run goes golden, super good run, then the opposite. I will keep going, man. Gotta go fast. Just it's how I feel. I gotta go fast, man. Don't have a choice. It's in my blood. <laughs> Bye, Sonic. <laughs> he got grabbed by the spider thing. All right, uh, let's see. Oh, he was saying greetings from Brazil. That's cool, man. I appreciate the greetings. I just, unfortunately, oh, Boa Noite is good evening. Oh, I see, I see. Okay. No. Oh, thank you very much, man. I appreciate it. Uh, Vexatia says there's a Japanese duck hunt in Loser's Side Top 8 and you want to win it all so bad? Yo, I'm sure he does some cool stuff. Alright, so this looks like we're in a bad spot, but it's actually very misleading. My splits are awful, and uh, we, can save, we can save time here, man. We can save plenty of time, no worries. That was good, that was good. Alright, alright. Which one is this? Number five, maybe? Uh, this isn't this isn't my best chaos emerald. It's it's really not. I had so much trouble on this one, but today. Today I'm going to persevere! Gosh darn it. We're gonna do good instead of bad. We're gonna get the chaos emerald. We're gonna celebrate. It's gonna be glorious. Glorious, I say. Well, I got a couple of rings. Can't be too mad about that. There we go, there's my Mach 3. They were set, man, I just gotta be good now. Yo, 
Where do you think you're going, UFO? You're almost there. Nice, nice, nice. I did it, man. Caught up to the stupid UFO. Oh, finally, man. We finally have five Chaos Emeralds. Two more. I just need two more Chaos Emeralds. It's two more. That's, that's all I ask. That's all I ask. Oops, I didn't want to go up there. Um, yeah, we need to go to the left side. This is where the other Chaos Emerald is. Uh-oh. What? You can go over here? <laughs> I didn't mean to do that. Oh, I didn't know that was possible. That's fine, that's fine. Yeah, we'll just be going up here, don't mind me. And this takes me up to where the next Chaos Emerald is. Gosh darn it. Okay, okay. Let's see what we can do. Should have grabbed any of those blue spheres, thanks. Oh, why'd I skip that turn? I needed those. Yeah, this level, man, the blue sphere placements is just all over the place. Not very good. Not for just getting across. Not so much. If I was good, I would grab this at Mach 1, I bet. Sure, it's possible. Ah, oh, come on, I was right there! I was right there, man. I decided to risk it for the biscuit. I was like, I can totally get it. If I just, if I take these jumps just right. Alright, yeah, no, man. These, these runs aren't happening anyways. I'm gonna go ahead and end the stream a little bit early tonight so that I can watch, um, the, uh, Evo that's going on right now. So I'll go ahead and host that. Let's see. Yeah, I'm huge into fighting games. I love fighting games quite a bit. Not sure if everybody else is also a giant fan. But yeah, let's see, is that Evo 2? That's the one that's doing, wait, it says Windjammers? Where's, where's, um, <laughs> where's Smash Brothers? Which, which Twitch channel is that on right now? Because I want to host whichever the one I'm going to watch. Evo 3 is Smash? Okay, okay, perfect. Um, are they doing Melee after Wii U or something? When's that? Either way, that's going to be me for tonight, guys. Much appreciation. You guys are the best. I'll hopefully catch you guys again tomorrow, where it'll be so much easier to be good at the video games, obviously. <laughs> Peace.